Hey everyone, in today's video I'm going to be showing you what the knife tool in Blender does, so let's get straight into it. So the first thing that you want to do is you want to go ahead and select your object, and then you want to go into edit mode. Now there are two ways to go into edit mode, one of them is by clicking on tab on your keyboard, and the other way is by going to the object mode section here, and then clicking on edit mode. And to use the knife tool, uh, it's located on the left of the screen, this is the knife tool right here, and you can use this to cut new topology on your object. Uh, so just like the bevel tool that I explained in the last in the last video, it does have a hotkey, and that hotkey is K. So if you press K in your keyboard, you're going to see this knife uh, thingy that's going to appear on your screen. And you can use this knife to cut holes in your objects. So just left click anywhere on your object to make these uh, small dots, and then and then once you have it all connected. Uh, you just want to click on enter on your keyboard and then you can see that you have um, a bunch of vertices and you can use these to move your object around kind of deform it or <laughs> move them in any way you want and if you want to cut uh, if you want to actually cut a hole in your object you want to go into face mode and the way to do that is by clicking 3 on your keyboard or going up here and clicking on face select so once you've uh, once you've done that, you wanna click the face that you've just made, and then you wanna click on delete or X on your keyboard, and then you wanna select on face, and that will delete that face and make a hole. So that's what the uh, knife tool does. It's used to make uh, a bunch of different topology on your object, and that's pretty much it. But one more thing that you need to be careful while using the knife tool is with smooth objects. So while using smooth objects, just like I'm using here, you can see that this is very smooth. If I shade it flat, you can see all the polygons and stuff that I have. But if I shade it smooth, it's just a smooth object. So with the knife tool, if I go into edit mode real quick and press on K to get my knife tool up, and then uh, just make a small quick hole in my objects. So just like that, and then hit on enter. You can see that it's kind of deformed the shape a bit and that it's the same for bigger and smaller holes as well it will deform the shape so yeah, you can see that this is very deformed but if it's shaded flat you can't really see the difference and even if there is a difference it's not going to make that big of a deal if you know what i mean so if i just shade it, shade it smoother real quick you can see that uh, it kind of messes up the topology on your uh, object so you've got to be very careful while using the knife tool in smooth objects so that's pretty much it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please hit that follow and subscribe button for more Blender tips and tricks.